Bruh, how you get a whole tree trunk in your finger though? All I know is I was running from the cops, tried to jump over a fence, something caught my finger, and it's been hurting ever since. Okay, so everything's all good here. The doctor should be in in a second. Good, I need to get this out of my finger ASAP. All right, my boy, I'll see you after you're done with the doctor. All right, see you then. Mr. Big Chris, nice seeing you again, and how are you doing today, sir? Other than my finger, I'm doing great. And what brings you in today? Well, mainly I came because I had this big tree trunk in my finger. See, look. Dang! Yeah, we'll take a look at that in a second. But first, it says here that you've gained 17 pounds since your last visit. So what are you doing for exercise? Like I told the nurse. Okay, says here no smoking, no drinking, exercising six days a week for an hour, eating plenty of fruits and vegetables, and you're taking all 15 of your medications. Okay. I exercise six days a week for an hour per day. Mostly cardio and weightlifting. Six days a week for an hour per day. <coughs> Excuse me. And how often are you eating fruits and vegetables? Every meal, doc. I'm basically vegan. Every meal? Okay. Yeah, doc, every meal. But honestly, I'm really only here for my finger today. Well, I'm gonna be honest with you. Unless you lose some of this weight, you're gonna have to continue taking all 15 of these medications. I'm really trying, Doc, but you know I had this slow metabolism. But I've been hearing a lot about this new diabetes medication. I really wanted to give that a try. And where did you hear about exactly? I heard about it online. Online, you say? Where, on TikTok? Well, you know, I looked it up on WebMD after I saw a commercial. Then I asked a few of my friends on Reddit. And you only want to try this medication to control your diabetes, not because you saw that it even kept Oprah skinny. It kept Oprah skinny? Oh, no, I got to try this. I'll consider it, but I did already have three other medications I wanted you to try. Three other medications? I'm already taking 15 and I really only came for my finger. Oh yeah, yeah, your finger, yes. Yeah, we'll get to that in a second. Good, cause this mess is killing me. So, what's your pain level on a scale of one to 10? My pain level? 11. 11, so I'm gonna put in for a psych evaluation. Hey, what is that? Okay, so that's all we need here. So I'm gonna check you out real quick. Thank God, I really need this on my finger. Okay, sir, so first, can I have you take a deep breath for me? Okay. <sighs> now cough. <coughs> and are you having any pain here? There? No. What about here? Nope, not there either, just my finger. Now open your mouth wide and stick your tongue out. Okay. Ah. Uh, now I'm gonna check your nose. My nose? And your ear. My ear? Ding! Okay, and your other ear. Okay. Yeesh. Okay, everything looks good under the circumstances. And did you have any questions for me? Yeah, what about my finger? Your finger, yes. We're gonna take care of that in a second. Any other questions? I mean, no, that's really all I came for. Okay, well, if that's it, I'm gonna have the nurse come in and see you and give you a little bit of information, and that'll be it. And I'll see you in six months. All right, Mr. Christopher, have a nice day. Wait a minute, you're not gonna take this out of my finger first? Your finger, yes, the nurse is gonna explain everything about that to you in a few seconds. Have a nice day, I gotta run. Okay, but it really hurts. All right, and I have your paperwork right here. My paperwork, okay. It says here that he referred you to the nutritionist, cardiologist, endocrinology, and the respiratory department. They should be giving you a call within the next week. If not, call the appointment center, please. Four referrals, okay. At least there's no psych evaluation. He ordered you three new medications for diabetes, cholesterol, and hypertension. And he also wanted me to mention that you should go to the nutritionist because he's not giving you any three medications. Well, why did he ask about my pain if he didn't want to give me a pain medicine? All right, and we're going to give you four vaccines today. That will be the COVID vaccine, flu vaccine, shingles vaccine, and pneumonia vaccine. Four vaccines? He didn't even talk about that. If you're still alive, he wants you to follow up in six months. So I'm just supposed to keep this redwood tree in my finger for six months? Our schedule isn't open yet for six months ahead. So you're going to have to give us a call in about four months to make that appointment. And here you go. Have a nice day, sir. What you mean, have a nice day, man? Who's going to get this shit out of my finger? Your finger? Oh, let me see that paperwork real quick. Man, here. Oh, I did forget to mention a nurse clinic appointment in one week to follow up on your blood pressure. Blood pressure check? What, are you going to squeeze my arm tight enough for the splinter to just fall out my finger? Ooh, you know what? Let me go ask the doctor real quick. One second. 
All right, man, I hope this is quick because I really got to go. Okay, and I'm back. And he said we could book a nurse clinic appointment for that. Another appointment, but I'm already here. And that was your right big toe? It's a splinter in my left index finger. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's why I'm trying to get it taken out. Okay, yeah, I remember. I remember. Okay, let me see. So we do have an appointment for three weeks from now, Monday morning, 8 a.m.? Monday morning in three weeks? Man, I already missed a day of work for this. Ooh, I understand. But the next appointment we have available after that is in seven weeks on a Tuesday at 9 a.m. Tuesday in seven weeks? Come on now. I thought y'all was going to take it out today. I guess I'll take the Monday one. So you'll take the Monday at 8 a.m.? Okay. I thought the doctor was going to take it out of my appointments, like they said at the appointment center. You thought the doctor? <laughs> yeah, a lot of people make that mistake. Well, you're a nurse. Why can't you just take it out? Yeah, I could easily take that out, but unfortunately, I'm not allowed to without a doctor's order. Well, what the hell am I supposed to do for three weeks? Uh, you probably want to stay away from using it. Don't let it go any deeper. Stay away from using it. I'm a bookkeeper. I type for a living. You type for a living? Well, how's that going for you? Does that pay well? Because I type 35 words per minute. And honestly, I can't stand this job anymore. Clearly. You know what? I just need to go. Anyways, let me write this appointment down for you. Left. Right. Left, left big toe. Three weeks, Monday morning, 8 a.m. Okay, here you go, sir. It's not my toe, it's my finger. Oh yeah, you're right, it's the finger, it's the finger. Got me waiting three fucking weeks, the fuck. Anyways, have a nice day, and if you have any questions, give us a call. But if it's an emergency, please call 911 or go to your nearest urgent care or emergency room. Thank you, buddy. Yeah, all right. Put it there. Oh, you can't. Well, have a nice day, sir. Fist bu you know what? Man, I'm out of here. This is why I hate the doctor.